Oh, the Winter Hill Stakes is next then. And this is one more two furlongs. It's Group Three, and it's a three-year-old and upwards. And the top one is Invaders Ridge for Jim Murray, Brunson for Hans Jones, Gate Sweet for Django, Mr. Bobby, Derek Hinton, Velvet Lad, David Rawson, Whistletown, Jim Murray, Hefi Habitus, Vinnie Gerard, Notre Dame, Firing, Molly at Surfer, the Cote d'Azur. Oh, Darren Thompson, Chizu Creator, Vinnie Gerard, Midnight Beyond the Sunset, I think that is for Molly at Surfer, Riot Lives for David Robertson, and Shotwave for Django. So 13 then, in this group three. And away they go. The Jim Murray pair a little bit slow out of the gate, but it's Hefi Habitus. Pulling for his head is the first to show Mr. Bobby up the centre of the track, and on the inside of that one, Velvet Lad. And Velvet Lad now looks like he might be try and go for the lead but Mr Bobby's having none of it and the Derek Hinton front runner gets across to the rail and quickly goes three or four lengths clear of Hefi Habitus and the Cote Resort Chizu Creator is also close up looking towards the back Riot Lights is just the back marker but it's Mr Bobby by about four lengths then to Hefi Habitus on the inside Invaders Ridge one of those Jim Murray slow starters has Got going again now, and he's up into second place. Also tucked away there, the coat does your you can't quite see that one. He just took right next to Hefi Habitus, but Mr. Bobby's in front. Brunson in the green jacket is coming around the outside as well. The one that's going widest of all looks like it might be Gate Sweet Shop Wave is another one in yellow as the screen freezes momentarily. And see what's going to happen we're off again we've got the five furlong pole now uh, mr bobby's in the lead so mr bobby's in front then from whistletown in second then the coat does your hefi have beat us right on the track brunson is still in it but look at this coat does your sweeping through now to challenge with four furlongs to go brunson up the center of the track on his own the vinnie gerard pair hefi have beat us and chisholm created trying to run on them velvet lad but it's mr bobby who's still in the lead by two mr bobby from the coat does your brunson velvet lad now going well chisholm creator here come the Jim Murray pair invaders Ridge and Whistletown it's Mr Bobby in the lead though Mr Bobby two furlongs to go now being hard pressed by Velvet Lad and the coat does your and Hefi Habitus and invaders Ridge and Whistletown and Chisel Creator is surely between these it's Mr Bobby then Still in the lead by a length, but being pressed by the Cote d'Azur. Hefi Habitus, Velvet Lad, Chisel Creator, Mr. Bobby repelling Raiders at the moment. Mr. Bobby into the final half furlough. He's still in the lead and he doesn't like he wants to stop. It's Mr. Bobby. This is another one for Hollywood Hinton and up towards the line. Mr. Bobby hands on a win to Hefi Habitus, the second the Cote d'Azur is third. And then after that, it was Invaders Ridge. I think Brunson might have been last in the end. But number two didn't get into that at all. Mr. Bobby. Game front runner, not quite say held on grimly because he won by three quarters of a length. It's, um, let's take a look. It's Mr. Bobby for Derek Hinton. The winner stayed on strongly for the group three on the firm ground at Windsor. Hefi Habitus for Vinnie Gerard was second. The Cote d'Azur for Darren Thompson was third. Invaders Rich Jim Murray fourth. And Vinnie Gerard got fifth as well with Chizu Creator.